Well, no doubt about it, the nerves have been jangling in the last few days, but very soon the wait will be over. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a thrilling finale. It's Monaco against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, it's a cup final. I love cup finals. I've played in a few in my time. Very, very lucky to do so. Won a couple, lost a couple. You don't want to lose today, that's for sure. But you have to be brave. You have to take the game by the scruff of the neck. Looking forward to both these sets of players making this an absolute cracker. Kevin well, this is the team Monaco have selected. I'll tell you what, you don't see this formation every day of the week. No, I mean, it looks very attack-minded with the three up front. The three in midfield supplying the width as well, but I'm a little bit worried about the three centre-backs. Will they get exposed in the wide areas? Introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters. Kaylon Navas is the goalkeeper. Marquinhos plays alongside Presnel Kimpembe at the back. Kylian Mbappe starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And playing up front today, Mauro Icardi. And they kick off here. Caio Enrique. Could it maintain possession, Monaco? And acres of space for PSG out wide. Neymar wishes he had that passing opportunity back. Mauro Icardi here. And a goal! The first of the contest! Well, it's always best to get your nose in front in the final. Really puts the pressure on the opposition. Well, Derek, as we see it again, it's a big mistake. You try to teach youngsters not to get caught in possession and be aware of what's around you. He has no clue, and he pays the price. Well, all the hard work has paid off, but the manager knows a lot more has to be done to secure this game. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Ben Yedder. Diop. Fluency of movement. Bofana. Ben Yedder. Yusuf Bofana. Bofana. Sidibe. Ganavin. And it's with Sidibe. Kevin Follant. Ben Yedder. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Paredes. Florenzi. Neymar. And here's Florenzi. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Diallo. Here's Icardi. Paredes. Mbappe. Now Neymar. He's just got to continue his run. Oh, really good reflexes and danger averted. Oh, 
It's a short corner. And the cross from Mbappe. Well, a header that was frankly miles off target. Well, technically, that was um, awful. Ben Yedder. Given away by Monaco. Well, Derek, PSG are dominating possession over this last 15 minutes. They've created a lot from midfield. Their forwards are having a field day. Coach will be really happy with the creativity, but he'd be even happier if he can extend their lead now. Very happy indeed. Icardi, now Neymar. Defensive efficiency personified. Golovin. And he's made headway. Teammate available. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Really good interception. Fruitful looking attack. Ben Yedder. Yusuf Fofana. Fofana. Folland. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Mauro Icardi here. And the ball's gone. And that is that for the first half here in the French capital. And back underway, PSG in front, but there might still be a few twists and turns before this game is over. Neymar. Verratti. Mbappe. Icardi. Paredes. This is Neymar. An authoritative challenge. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Not terrific pass. Crossing possibilities. It might be on for them. Folland! Oh, can you believe this? Just when it looked as though the door was locked, it's been reopened. Well, they're back in it, and you can hear the relief with their fans. Game on. Well, this is definitely worth another look. Superb interplay, so slick, but most of the blame has to be levelled at the goalkeeper. Your coach is a youngster to always protect your near post, and he just didn't do that and paid the price. Even Steven won a piece on this match. Neymar. Verratti. On to Diallo. Mbappe. Can he convert? And they nudge in front. Well, fabulous celebrations. They've got their noses in front, Derek. Can they stay there? Well, we'll see it again now. Was he aiming high? Pretty much looks like it to me. Leaning back slightly. He knows the ball's going to go just underneath the bar. Well, let's have another view of that goal.
Well, the coach has to be happy with that. Got their noses in front. Still work to be done, though. Well, 2 1 it is here. Diop. Ben Yedder. In possession, Folland. Well, terrific defending to stop them progressing. PSG possession stats are not too good, but on the break they've been devastating. The pace really hurts defences. They've been electric when they've had the ball. Golovin. And now Fonant. Oh, lovely incisive pass. Not problematic for the keeper. Di Maria. Here's Icardi. And Neymar. Mbappe. Pulls it back. Icardi. Will it be? And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. A trophy coming their way, surely. Well, here it is again. It's a better angle of it. He's leaning back, and that's why it goes so high. He's a little bit lucky. No, he won't care. Well, there's nothing better for a manager when a plan comes together. Total satisfaction. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3 1 it is. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Bofana. And they find a gap in the defence. Volant. Tremendous challenge. A good effect of pressure high up the pitch. And breaking at pace with Menace. Chances on. There's the goal. Surely not. Well, here's the replay. Super fast counter-attack football at its best. And that's a good header. Eye on the ball. Concentration. It's a lovely finish. A chance to revisit the goal. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Ganavin. Well, five minutes remaining, but you just feel this is over already. Aurelien Chouameni. PSG doing well to win it back. Ben Yedder. Good visualisation and execution. Ben Yedder. Well, that's a completely wasted throw-in. And the final whistle, the cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. And Lee, memories are being made. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't matter how much money you've got in the bank. Players will always look back at moments like these. These moments where you pick trophies up and win medals. Absolutely brilliant for this group of players.
Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, it's these moments, Derek, when you get your hands on the silverware and that little medal that goes around your neck might seem small now, but you'll look back at that, show your grandkids absolutely superb memories these players will have of this game. It's a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Yeah, it's been a long old road to get to this point. They're going to celebrate now and certainly celebrate long into the night, I think. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. And this is really special, getting to celebrate in front of your own fans, Lee. Well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place following their team. Now they get to join in the celebrations, go into the crowd and give them the cup, that's what I say. Well, then it might never find its way to the trophy cabinet, Lee. Well, all that hard work along the way in this tournament all comes together at the end when you pick the trophy up. Just look at them celebrating. A brilliant moment. Hard work indeed, Lee. The trophy now in their possession. 